Welcome back guys. Today we are talking about ending youth homelessness and helping those young adults get back on their feet right here in our community. Joining us today is Barbara Lewis, co-founder and board of vice president to tell us a little bit more. Barbara, I'm so excited to have you today. Thank you. I'm so glad to be here. We're so excited that we can actually let people know what we're doing here. Yeah, well, you are doing a lot, certainly for the young people in our community. So tell us a little bit about Faith and Fostering. What is it exactly that you guys do? Okay, primarily what we do, we have young people that are aging out of the foster care system, and it, they're between the age of 18 and 24. And we found that there's a gap in helping them and assisting them. I have two boys of my own and they are grown, but at 18, I couldn't imagine them stepping out and saying, okay, you figure this out. Yep. So that's what a lot of young people are facing every single day. So what we've done is we wanna bridge that gap. We wanna be an extension of the family. We have volunteers that wrap around them that help them make choices as far as career paths. So they can go and they can be on the job training. They can have uh, their uh, skills they can do the skills that, or they can go to college traditional college but they need help applying yes. and finding resources to be able to do that so that's what we're here to do absolutely and something really powerful Barbara that you said is you help your kids but these young adults mm -hmm. 18 to 24 yeah. some have no one they yes. don't have parents to look out for them to help them kind of through through life yes that's exactly what we found and so many of them have the gifts and the abilities to do something amazing but they don't have the resources and the people to help them every one of us have gotten where we've gotten because somebody helped us get here yes so that's what we want to do and one other thing that we do the module that's so important is we give them housing so That's they don't news. have to worry about that. So many struggle just to survive when yes. they're going through college to pay the bills. So what we do is we lift that burden off of them. We give them uh, apartments. They are paid for and they have food and different things, just the essentials that we take for granted every single day that we get, well, we provide that for them so that they can focus on their future and they can live that life of independence successfully and they will be able to provide for their and get future families. Yes, Barbara, what a great program and taking care of those basic needs. Mm -hmm. Then they can go on to do the rest of the things where it's going back to yes. college, getting a job, getting a vocational career, yeah. just so many options. Mm -hmm. But if you don't take care of those basic needs, mm -hmm. it's very tough for them to do so. Yes, exactly. We found that they end up just trying to survive yes. and um, a lot of lost potential because they never had the opportunity to go to school. And so we want to take care of those needs and they we are finding that they are more than able and capable and they are excited to have somebody just to say, I want to help. Yes. And they're willing to do that. Yeah. Absolutely. Barbara, how can someone get involved with the program Faith and Fostering, whether okay. they want to become part of it yeah. or just lend a helping hand? Okay. Well, this is our website. It is is faithandfostering.org and they can go online. This will, um, if someone wants to enroll in the program, a participant, mm -hmm. so that's the same way they would do it. If they want to donate, if somebody wants to donate to our organization, they can go on there as well and donate. Um, we are taking monetary donations and um, and then the other thing is volunteering. We need people that will wrap around these young yes. people and so you can also sign up to donate as well and it's faithandfostering.org. There you go. Thank you so mm -hmm. much, Barbara, for being with us today. You are so doing something so powerful in our community guys you can go to faithandfostering.org mm -hmm. to make sure that if you know someone that might benefit yeah. for this program or you want to lend a helping hand mm -hmm. you can definitely do it thank you again Barbara thank you so much for having us all right guys stay with us we found a hidden gem full of natural foods and products for your health and the family and your family I'm taking you there after the break we'll be right back